Hi friends, it's me Nikki here with my current favorites, the things that I have been loving as it relates to home decor, kitchen, personal, DIY, so let's jump right in. So let's talk personal favorites. What I am loving right now is my canvas bags. My husband and I have been doing a lot of weekend travel and I really wanted something where I can just throw my packing cubes in a bag and go to keep it simple every weekend and so these are work perfectly over the last couple weekends and they're canvas they're that denim feel very durable and very affordable I got them from Tuesday morning 40 14 bucks each you can't beat it the other two little accessory bags I got from Marshall's five dollars each so total 45 50 dollars for this whole set works great the only thing that I did not like about this whole setup is I didn't have a larger bag of the accessory bags for kind of my products and things like that because the big bag here is going to be for all my clothes and I typically just put all of my clothes clothes in that bag but the other bag I put my kind of toiletries but I like to have them kind of in their little bags here and so I was watching a lady Miss Crystal I've been following her for years on YouTube and she's actually a she does like makeup and style videos and she's also a Stella and Dot representative and she was talking about um, something that she's doing on her channel with Stella and Dot now a trunk show and I was watching that video so I said let me go to her site and when I went there I didn't realize Stella and Dot had bags and things like that also so I saw this beautiful striped bag in the blue I thought it would go perfect with the set be a nice contrast I love the stripe with the other design I thought it would be perfect and so I ordered it from her because I love this and so this works perfect for my toiletries and things like that so now I feel like I have a complete set so the next time I go out of town this weekend or next weekend I am good to go but this really has been one of my favorites because like I've said I've used it a couple weekends now and it's really it really has been working out great for me and I am a happy camper and I'll link her channel below definitely check her out I, I love her Okay, my next personal favorite is, you all know me, as from day one I've told you I like my Sims games, my computer games, all kinds of phone games. I'm just always in my downtime if I'm sitting in the dentist's office or wherever I'm, I am at, I love my little games. And so one that I was introduced a couple weeks ago was Daily Celebrity Crossword and I've been loving it because you get a new crossword puzzle every day and it's like pop culture so it's kind of things of today they have every day a different kind of theme like today is Friday so they have a sports fan Friday theme and so you can go in there you do the crossword puzzle for that day and it's a fun kind of outlet and I love these like fun outlets that I can do that don't take up a lot of time but kind of gives me that breakaway and so this is a great app a free app and millions of people play so it's really just a um, fun thing that I've been enjoying lately and so what I love about it is that it's kind of a, a compact crossword puzzle I don't have to carry a crossword book or anything like that and then I love the fact that I can see my wrong answers I can reveal the word when I'm kind of stumped on a word or anything like that and I love the themes of the puzzles I think that gets me most I, I hate those kind of stiff crossword puzzles that are boring and, and just too just too hard to do these are very just fun and I can just kind of enjoy doing it and so the thing about it is it's I love that it times you so you can see how much time it took you to do the puzzle and so my sister-in-law Angela and I we're very competitive with our little phone games and she's just upgraded her phone she used to be the flip phone girl and she's finally got her smartphone so now I'm gonna challenge her to put this app on her phone so that we can play each other so I'll link this app below definitely check it out much fun now let's talk kitchen now you guys know I'm in deep <laughs> kitchen renovation mode it's still going on but it is moving along faster now but you know about maybe two weeks ago I said okay I'm getting all new kitchen linens because mines were getting ratty and sometimes you have to just kind of get rid of the old put in the new and refresh and this was the time to do it and so I spent a couple hours went out shopping had a good time of course I ordered my crochet dishcloth that I always order from my same lady I'll link her below I that's the only one that I love getting my uh, dishcloths from she just really does a great job I can put bleach on these they really last they're very durable I just kind of love how she makes hers they they're just really gorgeous and perfect so I ordered a set of three from her on Etsy and again I'll link her below and then I went to, around to different places like Bed Bath and & Beyond and Tuesday morning and places like that to kind of look for my dish um, towels and things like that and I found found some microfiber ones I found these kind of um, bar mop dishcloth style here very affordable $2.99 for a stack of those and so you know I just because I was 
you know refreshing everything this was great pricing along with dish towels I, I love these I love the different designs I thought that they were beautiful and very affordable I got these for a set of three I think it was like five dollars and ninety nine cents which I think you can't beat it because dish towels today are they get, they're getting kind of pricey so that was very affordable there so I'm really happy with the style and the color and I have a unique way that I'm organizing them I'm not putting them typically in my drawer so I'm going to share that with you later if you're interested when I reveal my kitchen I'll figure out a time to share with that share with you that and so also I got new oven mitts I have been researching online for oven mitts because I wanted something that was the silicone mitts but I wanted the cloth on the inside and you know they were just kind of I wasn't seeing anything that I really liked or the reviews weren't good and so I went to Bed Bath & Beyond and found these which they were a little pricey so I what I was not happy about that but I said you know what I need them they'll last and so I went with it and I think they were nine bucks each so let's talk my kitchen renovation here now you guys know this coffee bar here I've had this for a couple years now and I bought it from Pier one I loved it it's very small and compact but this was my coffee bar and one of the very first videos I did on YouTube so it's just been with me a while and when we did the kitchen renovation or while we're doing it and I should I say I knew I wanted to upgrade kind of my coffee beverage bar to something more of a just kind of more substantial so I went on overstock.com and I saw this here and yes, it's nice and I love the bones of it, but I'm going to tweak it a little bit to fit my style. It has more of a country feel to me here, but it was perfect for what I needed, perfect size and everything. So when they're putting in our granite countertops in our kitchen, they're going to put granite on top of this to cover that wood piece there. That way this piece is going to blend into my other cabinetry, along with when we, when we special ordered our cabinet um, knobs here and our pools, um, I got extra to go onto this so that again, this piece is going to kind of flow into my piece, my other cabinet. Cabinets, but I wanted something that was kind of different than my normal cabinets I didn't want stock cabinets over my coffee bar because I wanted to kind of give a little bit of the Nikki a little bit of me um, in the kitchen I didn't want it to be all just kind of stock kitchen cabinets so that brings me to this piece here that I found on Craigslist for $150 there is a bottom piece also but I just wanted the top piece to go over my coffee bar in the kitchen I thought it would be perfect to put like my coffee teacups espresso cups and all of that in there and I love that it brings a a little character to my kitchen because I looked at stock cabinets and I just was not happy I said it would be too blah and I want it to bring another touch so we're gonna mount that to the ceiling so it's going to look built in but of course we got to do some work to it so my husband here he's just deglossing it and I can't show you the end result yet because we're not complete yet we're still working on the kitchen so in between traveling and our work schedule school schedules and everything things have been crazy but we're getting it done and so um, we've got it painted so far so now we're almost ready to mount it um, on the wall but I'm so excited to see it done I'm so excited to see this kitchen done and I can't wait to share it with you also bear with me next favorite thing that I got is my new coffee espresso combo machine I have been eyeing this for a while you know I knew with the new coffee bar I wanted a espresso machine I've had a combo espresso coffee machine in the past and so when I was doing my research I watched plenty of videos and different things and you know espresso machines can get a bit pricey but I am NOT at that level where I need to invest in an expensive espresso machine I'm just not um, uh, you know at that level yet so this is the perfect price point for the perfect machine that gives me the perfect function for what we need somewhere where I can make coffee if I want to make coffee and then when I want to make my espressos or lattes or whatever I have that all in one unit here and I'm in love with it I really really love it and then the Keurig is going to work out perfectly because that's what we currently also have that's going to go to work with my husband because he really needs a coffee um, maker Keurig at his job so he can use that at work so everything worked out perfectly so I love this I love that it has the stainless steel which will kind of come into uh, matching my kitchen perfectly I also love at the top here it has this heating element where I can put my um, espresso or coffee cups on there and it warms your cup so that you have that perfect cup of coffee so I'm excited to use this it's still a brand new right out the box because the kitchen is a wreck because we're renovating it but as soon as we put everything together you'll see everything in place and then if you want me to do anything in more detail about this or here in the future let me know I'd love to share more details about this so here was my naughty purchase here. These little mini ceramic white shot glasses. They were in Tuesday morning and I was in there. I don't know what I was getting, but I knew I was not supposed to be getting these because I wasn't there for that purpose. And you guys know, I tend to like to just shop quarterly. I hate to just, you know, accumulate too much. But when I saw these, I 
walked past me and I said, oh, Nikki, no, oh, Nikki, no. And then I walked by and I said, you know what? I have to have these because when I come back, they're not going to be here. And I thought they'd be perfect for the holidays. You guys know how in my entryway, I like to do welcome drinks as guests come in to have little welcome drinks. I thought this would be perfect for that. Also, you guys know that I have a lot of different tasting dishes and things like this. You could do a little dessert in here, either a little shrimp cocktail in there. You could just do so many different things with these mini kind of glasses here. And I think they're unique in the fact that they're um, typically only see these in glass and things like that but these are that white kind of um, ceramic that I love and so I have a set of eight of them and they're two different styles four in each style so I love these works perfectly so let's talk home decor and the first thing I am in love with is this face that my sister-in-law Jessica made for me she sent it to me uh, I want to say about a week ago and I absolutely love it for my office and I just think it's so beautiful you guys know I just love anything monogrammed it just you know I see it monogrammed and I'm all over it and when I saw this and it's extra special because she made it and so I love it with my pens and pencils for my desk and the great thing about it is it coordinates so well with that vase that I did remember I recently did a DIY to show you some kind of Kate Spade inspired desk accessories I'll link that video below if you missed it but that's the vase that I made um, over there where Kate Spade's vase was like 70 or 80 dollars and I made this doll for like three or four dollars and so but if you look at them together they work perfectly so the vase that my sister-in-law monogram one that she made for me looks great for my pens and pencils and then sitting next to this vase um, it looks just perfect and I'm really loving them both together so I'm so appreciative that she made that for me and of course, the next thing I'm loving is my new chair. And I have a video that I shared with you, some tips on how I decorate with neutrals. I'll link that video below if you missed that. And in that, I, I unveiled this chair that I recently purchased from Safavea. I love it. And I just it's just such a nice welcome in my home. Along with my welcome pillow. I ordered this off Etsy for my guest bedroom. It was custom made. And I have to say, it's a bit on the pricier side. And I really probably could have found this cheaper somewhere else in the same linen but because the site she customized you know to anything you want I didn't realize I, I realized after the fact I was like well I'm just using a general word I'm not like putting our name or anything so I should have just really kind of searched out a different pillow but in the end I love it I will be working on my guest bedroom finally soon after the kitchen so I wanted to have this pillow in place so let's talk DIY crafting favorites. So I'm in love with these beads here. You guys know I love purchasing beads for my bead pins because it allows me to change up my desk accessories like my pins and things to kind of keep me looking fresh in my office. I like to change things up because it keeps me motivated but I don't want to spend a lot of money. So these beads were $2.99 for the set and they had a ton of this style so I was able to load up. I love these and it allows me to change out my pins and so here I changed out my pin. It looks absolutely great and I love it I did a tutorial on how to make these pins along with some resources for buying the things I'll link that video below also but it just really is a fun pin and I love it and I love it with this journal that my sister-in-law uh, Jessica also sent me it just goes together nicely takes two minutes to change out my beads but it gives me a whole new look and inspires me when I'm working at my desk you have to do things like that when you work at your desk a lot and so the journal that she actually gave me is just gorgeous whatever you do do it with all your heart and then what I love most about this is inside the journal they have on every page they have a different scripture from the Bible and I just thought this was so nice and it's just really just an inspirational journal I love journals I'm a journal addict along with my two new pens so I hope you have enjoyed seeing some of my current favorites, the things that I'm loving. I hope you all are doing great. I will put links to everything below. So definitely, if you're interested in anything, definitely check it out. Definitely go get that free app for that crossword puzzle. You will love it. I hope you all are doing great. And this is Nikki saying goodbye.